biggest deals we've ever done at one time. I think it is the biggest deal. It's technically probably the biggest deal we've ever done at once. Uh, it's weird because it's probably the mo more expensive deal, yeah. but as far as volume goes, it's, I don't know that it's the most games we've ever picked up at once. Yeah. We're picking up a bundle, a box, of brand new games, um, all sealed, and potentially, depending on the arrangement that we come up with on site, um, controllers, headsets, things of that nature. So she sent me over a spreadsheet. Uh, it's another reseller who bought a pallet that just was loaded with video game stuff. So she sent me a um, another, uh, she sent me a spreadsheet with a breakdown of everything. And I said, a lot of this stuff, I'm gonna have to just see it. So we are on the way now to pick it up. Hopefully we'll do really well with it. We have made it to our destination. Let's get yeah. out and go see what kind of stuff we got. Let's go. 100% sure. All right, guys, we have secured the goods. I don't even know what you can see when you can't see. We have tons of boxes oh, of stuff to go through. We actually so picked up a little bit more than we expected. Yeah. But I feel pretty decent about it. Now we're gonna go back to the house and- Sort through it. Sort through it on and see what we got. All right, everybody, we are back at the house with our haul. You saw earlier in the video, myself and this cat right here picked up a ton of really, really great stuff. Now, before we start filming, this guy right here started going through everything. He started calculating what he thinks we're gonna make in potential sales. Yeah, I added it all up. Well, hang on, don't, don't spoil it yet. So hang on, before you go digging into everything, okay? We're gonna separate everything by unsorted inventory, semi-sorted inventory, these cool things here and these cool things here, okay? So on the count of three, everybody clap with me. You ready? One, two, three. Oh wait, that was terrible, do it again. One, two, three. So here is our haul for the, today. Let's go. Just kind of get a brief little overlook of everything in here. Crazy, crazy stuff. And then we got some Switch stuff, some open games. So here's how this all worked out. I met somebody who buys pallets and they usually deal with furniture and they usually deal with home goods and they stumbled across a pallet filled with electronics and video games. So. We did a little negotiating back and forth on Marketplace, and she said she would much rather sell to me than have 150 different people come into her house trying to buy one game, one item at a time. So here's what we got. We started digging through stuff. This guy right here couldn't wait to film the video, so he started digging through, and he's already sorted this. So why don't you tell us what you have estimated right here so estimated all of this based off of price charting based off of price charting sixteen hundred and fifteen dollars just these items right here okay now we know that after listing fees ship ne negotiations best offers all that stuff we won't make sixteen hundred dollars off of I'll that say around twelve hundred yeah, probably. I mean, just depends if we can. I mean, it's a lot of copies of Madden 24, Madden 24 sealed on PS5. It's hot right now. NBA 2K24 technically listed higher for 40. this one. Just bread and butter all day long. Oh, we got an NBA in the middle of all these Grand Theft Autos. But Grand Theft Auto Premiums, I believe the premium comes with DLC or shark cards. Not 100% sure on that one. But we've got all these copies of FIFA. Now, this is the inventory that we have not gone through yet because you've started on one box in our office and we're like, wait a second, we gotta break this out and take the table. So we've got all this stuff right here and I believe there's eight games I've already, four I've already sold today and then four or five more sitting in the office that are pending. So 
with all that being said, we've got, let's just kind of point out some cool stuff. So, uh, you know, Little Big Planet 3, not a very expensive game. So we've got that, that uh, Mass Effect Andromeda. Those are going to be super cheap. But we've got a couple copies of this Spyro Reignited Trilogy. I can't remember if we actually have a copy of this or not. If we, I'm pretty sure we do. If we don't, we'll keep one. All right, guys, we're going to cut in with a little voiceover. I'm sitting here with Pax. Hey. And what we wanted to do is rather than put a bunch of comps in, we want to share with you just a few updates, I guess, on this haul. We immediately after filming this recap jumped onto Whatnot and we sold a handful of items making $735 in total sales in about an hour, hour and a half, roughly. And then a few days later, we did it again making about $650 in total sales. Yeah. I will put up screenshots from those whatnot sales. And so in one week, we had made our projected amount of money. We thought we were going to make between $1,200 and $1,400. And we made that in really 36 hours, not including eBay sales. Yeah. So what we'll do is we'll update you guys in a future video once this whole lot is gone, but so far in one week, we have made over $2,000 in total sales. What you think about that? It's good. Farming Simulator 19, let's see, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. That's we actually, one. someone saw the picture we posted and they've already dibsed that one. Assassin's Creed Odyssey on here. Saints Row, the new Saints Row. This Pac-Man down here, this PS5 Pac-Man, that's yeah, probably staying. Oh, Pac-Man. <laughs> Miraculous. There you go. Look at there. Noah, that was a game oh, for you. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Actually, you go. Zoe was looking at this game. <laughs> it was a joke, yeah. yeah Zoe, will, Zoe will most likely this want one, that. This one's really cool. Yeah, yeah, and it's a great game. So, uh, for Spoken, I almost bought this the other day at the uh, Overstock Marketplace. Ooh. Oh, this one's a game, dude. Alien Vs. That. Elite. Yeah, that that that's a, uh, a more multiplayer focused game that we could play together. Now, let's look at this Switch stuff. So we got five Switch games, two sealed copies of uh, Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. I'll put up a sold comp for that one. Definitely, that one will sell. Uh, Fast and Furious that'll sell. Sealed Switch games, this is good stuff. Now, we did get a couple um, not sealed games. So close to Protocol, I own it digitally. Don't own it physically. That's going in my collection. That's personal collection. Just dance. It's all broken. It doesn't matter. There's, I mean, there's plenty of them over here. But yeah, it, you know, this one's already open. You're right, the case is cracked. But you know what? We've got plenty of cases. I'll swap that, stick that on the shelf. And then we have plenty of sealed ones to sell. Ghost Recon Breakpoint, we've got that one. These will be whatnot titles for sure. Now, this is really cool. We have a... A lot of this stuff is open box, so we're going to have to test it. Anything open box, we're going to have to test. That's where a lot of our time is going to be stuck. Um, but we have this Zelda Nintendo Switch headset, which is awesome. This was still sealed. Mario Kart 8 wheel. So that's yeah. pretty cool. We have this Xbox One charging stand, a little dock. So that's pretty cool. Sounds like it's pretty loose in there. Uh, we have these headset um, controller combos. These are awesome. We also got these Nintendo Switch and PC. They're called Switch Plate. So you have these controllers that work for the Switch and PC, which is awesome. And they have come with two different face plates. Ooh, that's cool. So that's pretty neat right there. You can have a white controller or you can have a black controller. So we'll, this one looks like it's open. I don't know if the other ones are, but we'll have to test all those out and make sure they work. So that's really cool. Any of this stuff that doesn't, maybe it's not necessarily great for eBay. Maybe it's not necessarily great for whatnot. We'll take and we'll put in our booth at the Overstock Marketplace. Now these right here, they're so cool. I had no idea. Oh, the masks? Yeah. They're in the other room. That's all right. We'll, we'll, we'll show that off in a minute. This right here, glow in the dark, splatter paint. When I looked at those, I was Xbox like, Xbox controller. That's cool it. Is that? If I was an Xbox player, I would want this. That's so what I would want. Here is the thing I wanted to point out to you boys. Okay, look. All right, some of these, like the these right here, these neon yep. controllers, they include a month of Xbox Game Pass. You know what I think happened? What? People bought them, redeemed the code, and returned them. I bet these have never actually been used. 
And look how many we have. Two, oh, four, six, wow. eight, ten, twelve of these total. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. So I bet that they, because and one when I one of these that's kind of torn, the Game Pass slip was in there, so I pulled it out. So I'm gonna test those. We'll test the controllers and see if the codes are in there. But that's really cool. And I didn't even know that was a thing. But that's a really good idea. Sell a third party controller with a month of your service. So same thing goes with this. These headsets. Mm -hmm. Boom. They come with a, oh, yeah, they do. A, a month of Game Pass. So we have four of these PDP headsets. Now, we've used these before for PlayStation. So those are decent headsets as well. Oh, they work for, and, they work for PlayStation? Well, they just plug right into the... Uh, controller? If I'm not mistaken, these plug right into the controller. So oh, This is such a cool headset. Yeah, I love the glow. Cool. If it works for the PlayStation, you can have it. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes sometimes we got to take That a one's cooler, though. That one's that <laughs> that is, wild. That, that's seriously. So, if I was an Xbox player, that would be my... That's right. That's right. That's cool. And then these right here are super, super so cool. So what is it? So these are Joy-Cons, essentially, but they're made mm. by Hori, and they're bigger. And look, they've got the... Thumb the, grip, the grips. They've got the back buttons. That's what I meant. Yep. The split pad compacts. Is that a back button or is that a grip? It's a, it's a back button. What does it say? Rear trigger. Rear trigger, yep. So there you go. So these right here sell really well as well. Now this right here is awesome. We actually have one of these. Um, I have it downstairs in the eBay room. These controllers, these Switch controllers are yep. super, super cool. And they glow in the dark. How dope is that? So guys, look at this. We've got That's crazy tons of controllers. We got headsets. We've got Game Pass for years. Game Pass for years. If we decide to use it, copies of the Skywalker saga. Like I don't have that. One of those going into the collection for sure. Five, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yep. 13 yeah. of those. So we get, 13 ga we get Game Pass for a year. Okay. And then look, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Wait. No, I well, it all so is. not all of them ha come with it. I don't think these came with Game Pass. Yeah, these a did. Year, a year and one month. No, they might. I don't know. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, those. 19, 20. So 20 years? Yep. So there you go. So at total, there were 28 accessory pieces. 20 months. Okay. And then we had, we bought 147 games, not including the loose games. Those were thrown in as we were making the deal. So you guys ready to know how much we paid for all this? I know. I know. Okay. Eight hundred and fifty dollars yep. for all of this right here, bringing our price per unit to five dollars. As a matter of fact, actually, our price per unit on the accessories because they're off brands. I was nervous about taking on a lot of the off brand stuff. Four dollars and sixty cent is actually what we paid per unit over there, and these, not including this stuff right here, was five dollars per unit. These are off brands. Yep. PDP, yeah, it's, it's, it's Xbox licensed, but it's not original Xbox control. Do you think this could work for PS4? Do you think if I plug this into my PS4, it would work? No. Also, you would your buttons are going to be weird, but it'll work for PC. You sure it won't work for PS4? You think so? I'm positive. You want to try it? I mean, I'm, I'd be interested to try it. I've never tried it. Because it's not Xbox controller. Well, it is Xbox licensed, which means... It's, it's Xbox licensed, but it's designed for Xbox. That doesn't I, mean it has I wonder if these will work. Maybe. But then again, your buttons are going to be all janky. It's going to be weird. And Not for Xbox. It's the same thing, just with different stuff. Well, so. let's find out. I'm pretty sure. As a matter of fact, comment below if you think this nerd is wrong. I think I'm right. I mean, okay. I'm just saying. Now, pick a game, guys. What do you guys think is the most valuable game of the lot? Easy. So he thinks I Madden 24. He thinks Madden or NBA. Actually, it is Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 every year. So, and oh, yeah, and yeah. these Diablos. Price really? right now, those are pretty high. Yep. Yeah, those are hmm. so. second most expensive. This is the third. As far as we know, I mean, we haven't gone through this stuff, but I'm pretty familiar with these titles. Yeah. So, what do you guys think? Did we do good? Oh, we, we do oh, better yeah. than good. All right. It's so, just these playing $5 for a Madden game or it's Madden 24. Madden 24 is 25. Yeah, I know. No, it's not that. We have. It's more than that. Oh, yeah. We already sold 28 today. Yeah. So, all right, guys, let us know in the comments below how did we do? Which one of these games is your favorite? Is there anything cool in there? I'm is there that one? Vanguard. You're in Vanguard? Yeah. 
Let's go play it. Look, the demo looked good because me and Dad played the demo together. Yeah. It looked good. Yeah, let's go play. So, guys, like I said, let us know down below if there's anything in there. And if there's something that you guys are interested in that we have in the videos, uh, comment down below. And we have links in our link tree to our email and stuff. Email us. Let us know. Um, we will definitely be posting this stuff up very, very soon. Matter of fact, some of this stuff's already been listed. And we'll keep you guys updated on how our video game buyout... How it goes, how we did. Should we do it again? Should we take a chance on buying these pallets ourselves? Ooh. So, all right, be sure to like, share, subscribe, do all the things, and we'll catch you on the next one. <laughs>